Amen. I remember when the Lord first called me to preach when I was 10 years old. Amen. And I tell you, I've been doing my best to live for God ever since. And I'm not going to quit running until I make it all. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 Praise the Lord. Praise, Praise the Lord. Lord. I want to say it's an honor and a privilege to be here. Yeah. We say Jesus. Amen. For allowing us to come, Sister Brenda. We said her tonight. I've known since for a long, long time. Over 30 something years. Over 34 years. I've known yes, her. Amen. And uh, her family. And, uh, met them a long, long time ago. They came and preached uh, down to Sister Blake and them down in uh, Wilmer, Alabama. And those sprinkles. And that's where I met them there. And then they came over to where my wife's folks had a church. And, Man, we enjoyed them so much and we came friends with him. My wife did. She wrote her a bunch of times. Yes, I mean. God well, bless her south and I'm get married with them together this year. It'll be 34 years. Praise the Lord. I appreciate it all. Yeah. Yes. I believe that marriages can still work. Yes. Come on, brother. Amen. Yes, I mean. If you stay with God, you live with God with all your heart. God keep you together. Yes. Praise God. Yes. And I'm glad things ain't changed. And like the brother Wallace said a while ago, Brother Randall, I, I don't like this new modern day religion. Amen. I don't like all this worship singing. Amen. The modern worship singing they doing ain't no power in it. Hallelujah. Uh, ain't no anointing in it. Wow. Come on, somebody. Yes. Come Hallelujah. We need that power back right. yes. in the church house. Yes. We need the power yes. of God back in the land today. Yes. Listen to me, folks. We can't make it without the power of God. Amen. Right. It's the truth. Amen. We Amen. need the Spirit and the power yes. of God. Yes. Hallelujah. Acts 1 and 8, he said, after that, the Holy Ghost has come upon you. He shall receive power. Yes. Yes. We're living with a powerless Pentecost today. And the church has lost its power. They passed it on God. And they traded the power for entertainment. And that entertainment never saved us. Yes. Hallelujah. That praise and 
seeks his face. You know, you know I'm reminded when Elijah ran and hid from Ahab and Jezebel. Oh, come on. Well, Jezebel, <laughs> that God that came and thought, God, I'm the only one left. Come on. Praise God, ain't nobody else but me. And I know right. God's scared because Jezebel's going to have my head. Hallelujah. And Jesus said, Amen. You're not the only one. Amen. Like Seven thousand that ain't bowed their knees. Woo, hallelujah. I believe God's raising up an army today. Yes, oh, hallelujah. Amen. Come on, somebody. Oh. I believe that God's raising up an army that's real. Come on. Ain't that not a put on, not a fake? Come on, somebody. Come on. Yes. Remember when my boss used to have a little saying, "Fake it till you make it." Praise God. I refuse to be a fake. Amen. That's I ain't got it. I ain't got it. Come on, right. somebody. Come on. Hallelujah. How many of you know you can have it? Yes. yes. Oh. Oh. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. You have it? Hallelujah. Amen. Come on, That's believe what you're preaching. Come on. Yes. Now and then he turns around and he says, Tell you, believe what you're praying. Yes. Pray what you believe. So yes. Say, oh, Amen. Yes. Oh, oh, we either are or we ain't. That's the right. truth. Come on, somebody. Come on. But I refuse to be a has been. Come on. Yes. Come on, somebody. And I refuse to be a war to be. Hallelujah. I want the goods. How about you? Yes. Amen. I said, I want the goods. Yes.
you know, you get what you preach. I said, you get what you preach. Years ago, preachers preached the Holy Ghost. Now they don't preach it no more. They get people in church and get them to say the Lord's Prayer. First thing they tackle on, you saved. Come on. Come on. You don't need to stop with the sinner's prayer. Come on, Amen. That's it's a right. start and that's good. But you need to go on through the Holy yes. Ghost. Yes. Come on. You need yes. the Holy Ghost. Yes. Yes. Amen. I'm going to preach the Word tonight. Hallelujah. Oh, preach it, brother. It's just time to preach the Word. Yes, it is. Get a backbone like a saw. Oh. And I tell the people the church in there. Come on, somebody. Yes. Hallelujah. He said, repent and be baptized, every one of you, in the name of Jesus Christ for the remission of sin. Hallelujah. And shall receive the gift. Yes. Holy Ghost. Right. Come on, yes. somebody. Yes. yes. He said, without my spirit, you're none of mine. That's right. That's it. You ain't got the Holy Ghost. You ain't got God. Come on. That's right. Amen. It's the truth. Preacher, that's some steel words. That's the Bible. Yeah. It's the Bible. That's the Bible. Come on. Yes, somebody. it is. We want to turn our world upside down. We need to get back to the Bible. Yes. We need to return back to it. Yes. He said, return to me, and I'll return to you, said the Lord. Yes. And I believe God's calling the people back to the altar, back. Is the only hope for this nation. Yes, it, it is. is. Yeah. Somebody say amen. 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 Yes. Our poor old president got up not long ago on national television and said, America ain't no longer a Christian nation. Said instead we're a multicultural nation now. We're a, we're a nation of many gods. Hallelujah. How I many all know God destroyed people because of many gods? Amen. It's a truth. God. Come on. He yes. Said, Faith one Lord and one family. Hallelujah. Yes. yes. Lord. Woo. Lord. 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 Yes. We need to get back to believing in God. We need to get back to believing that He is. That's the truth. He's trying to turn this nation away from God. But the church needs to stand up. Yes. Come on. So we need to stand up. Yes. Come on. He said, let the redeemed of the Lord say so. Say so. Yes. Yeah. That fat bones come like jellyfish. Somebody say amen. Amen. It's the truth. Preacher, I don't want to rock the boat. The boat needs to be rocked. Yes, it does. People need to repent. Get a hold of God. Yes. If we don't get a hold of God, God's going to destroy the nation. It's the truth. Hallelujah. Not only the nation, but the world. Of course, yes. we know what the Word of God has said about that. But I also believe that He said that my people, which are called by my name, would humble themselves and pray and seek my face and turn from the wicked ways. He said, of everything that blows. That's the truth. Somebody say amen. amen. That's the truth. Hello. We need to get back, don't we? Yes, we do. And we'll get back God. So we'll turn to Him, He'll turn to us. Yes, He will. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. I'm tired of seeing empty hands. Holy, holy, holy. 
Come on. Amen. Huh? Yes. I heard some good testimonies this week. About the tent meeting, I'm so glad. That's what it's all about. Yes, it is. Come on, somebody. Yes, it is. How many of y'all knows we used to have it? Some of us still got it. Mm -hmm. Most of the church world ain't got it no more. That's the truth. That's the truth. We used to have a monopoly on this thing. We used to be the majority. Now we become the minority. Uh huh. Come on, somebody. Come on. Yes. TVNs took over our church. That's a truth. Come on. That's Come on. The TVNs truth. took over the world. Come yes. Come on, somebody. Yes. Hallelujah. But you know what? That's fallen. People's leaving TVN by the droves. I know there's still hundreds of thousands that fallen. But I, I was reading the other day where the charismatic church is losing their following. Hallelujah. People's getting tired of dead child religion. Woo! They want to feel something. Come on, somebody. How you know yesterday when people got the Holy Ghost? Even if they stay saved. Hallelujah. Yes, they did. Hallelujah. How they're saved at the Somebody. Yes, it will. Amen. Careful, preacher. Don't want to hurt nobody. Preach it, brother. Preach it. I'd rather hurt you now. Amen. That's the truth. Go to hell with you, and you hurt me later. That's Come it. On. That's it. Somebody say oh, amen. Amen. Hallelujah. We, we need the power back. Yes, All we right. do. Yes. We need power to change lives. Yes. Come on, somebody. Yes, amen. When I grew up, I was a child. We've seen things happen. Yeah. Uh huh. People pray through. Come on. Forty yes. some years later, that I'm living for God. Yeah. People that I prayed through with back then are still living for God. Oh, oh, God. God. Uh huh. Come on, uh -huh. Uh -huh. Come on brother. Something's wrong when people claim to get saved tonight and tomorrow. I see they're it. Right back out in the world. I see it. They, they always done. Always done. You know why? Because there ain't no real power. Amen. It's the oh. truth. Right. Yes. We live in a day when there's more playboys than prophets. That's it. Come on, somebody. God ain't looking for a pretty boy. Uh -uh. Come on, he ain't looking for a playboy. Come on. He's uh -uh. looking for a preacher man. Come on. A preacher woman. Come on, you Thank you, Jesus. So be not drunken with wine. That's right. Amen. Come Wherein on. is excess. But he said, be ye filled with the Spirit. Right. Yes. Yes. I mean, almost when you get filled up, uh -huh. you don't run out the next minute. No, uh -huh. Come on. It's a you almost when you get a belly full, it stays with you for a while. Come yes, on, it brother. does. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Come on, somebody. Yes. Amen. It's the truth. We need to get filled. Yes, we do. Yes. yes. Holy, holy, holy. Hallelujah. Glory, 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 glory. Come on, brother. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. He will come. Jesus. Have to stand out from under the Amen. It's the truth. I remember I preached revival on Lookout Mountain. I uh, had a little army tent back then and uh, it wasn't very big. I think I did manage to get about 40 or 50 chairs under it and that was jam-packed. And God packed that tent out and people come from everywhere. I've never seen so many people in all my life. And they came in pickup trucks and they would let the tailgates down and fill the beds of the pickup trucks and the tailgate of the pickup trucks and and they come, brought lawn chairs. And man, the the, the, the sin was just beat the yards. Praise was God. Full. Thank you, Jesus. Praise God. Cars parked all down the highway. Praise God. Hallelujah, Jesus. 
Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, Jesus. Praise God. I'm ready to see them days come back again. Yes, amen. Man, when I pull up tonight, I told you, Sam, I said, probably when we get there, ain't going to be nobody there in this kind of weather. And I got even seen the cars outside. And I thought, my God, revival's going to break out. Yes, hallelujah. Sure enough. <laughs> hallelujah. People get hungry for God, but they'll come out on it. Hallelujah! How I many y'all know God will honor their desire? Yes, He will! Yes! And I'm praying that this thing will break out and they won't be able to shut it down. Uh, hallelujah! Hallelujah! Down yonder in McIntosh, this is their 10th week of revival. Hallelujah! Baptist Church, everybody in there's got the Holy Ghost. <laughs> Amen. People, Woo! Hallelujah! Come on, somebody! Miracles are happening. The glory's falling. Thank you, Jesus. Christian Bible, Mobile. 75 teenagers get the Holy Ghost in six weeks. The drug dealers, they're like the one busted. They call the preacher and said, if you don't get rid of that evangelist, we will. Said he's done about broke us. Everybody was buying from us, ain't buying no more. And said, if you don't get rid of him now, said, we'll come up there and we'll get rid of him for you. Pastor called me, said, Brother Salisbury, we got an end tonight. And I said, why? He said, I got threatened today. My life got threatened. He said, your life got threatened. Hallelujah. I said, I ain't worried about nobody threatening my life. Hallelujah. Come on. Hallelujah. Praise God. They kill me, it'll be a shortcut to glory. Hallelujah. Oh, I'll still be preaching. So I shall praise God. I want to see a shut down the drug dealers. I want to shut down the boot. Woo! Yes. Come on, somebody. Yes. Hallelujah. A revival break it out. Come on, somebody. Come on, brother. Some of us got so big for our britches. Come on. And that ain't us doing it, it ain't getting done. Lord help me. God don't need you. Amen. It's the truth. God can show you. Come on. But he don't need you. Amen. That's the truth. He'll raise up somebody else to do it. Yes, he will. Bible said he'll raise up the rocks and that cloud. Yes, hallelujah. Come on, somebody. Come on. You start using these donkeys around here in these hills. To I see it. Preach the word if you don't. Amen. That's the truth. That's Somebody the truth. Say amen. 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 That's the truth. Thank you, Jesus. Now, I tell you, I like what I feel under this tent. Yes, amen. Yes. Glory to God. Glory. Yes. I wouldn't be surprised if y'all was here eight, nine, ten weeks. Hallelujah. Boy, take this tent down. Praise God. And y'all are going to start setting chairs up. Outside, go get Praise a big God. tent set up on this hillside. Come on, somebody. Praise God. Praise God. Y'all might have to use that parking lot next door. Thank you. That's a pretty Thank you, Lord. parking lot next door. <laughs> Hallelujah. Come on, somebody. Praise God. I'm ready for it, don't you? Woo! Yes. You know, we ought to believe God for such as that man. Yes. Yes. Amen. Amen. Preaching not long ago. And I said, I'm believing God for a 50 soul revival this week. The preacher got up at the end of my preaching. He said, we ain't ready for no 50 soul revival. Uh -oh. What's not to be ready for? Oh, that's the truth. My God, sons and daughters getting the Holy Ghost. Oh, right. What's yeah. not to be ready oh, for? Amen. That's the truth. People ain't having revival. That's the truth, oh, brother. That's why this bunch of yellow amen. belly, amen, skunk field preachers, amen, won't have revival. That's the no truth. Ain't nobody in their church anymore. They don't believe God no more. Come on, son. Yes, it's you a know truth. What Yes, he can. That'll let him. That'll let him. Should I work, but who'll let me work? Come on. Yes. Mm -hmm. Come on. Hallelujah, Jesus. God used a 12-year-old boy. Uh-huh. In the Bible. Little buddy. 
Come on, somebody. He was. Went out there and conquered the giant. Yes, he yes, did. Yes, amen. All his brothers out there hiding, scared to death, shouting in their shoes. That's the truth. The whole army of Israel hiding, shaking in their shoes. Yeah. Every time that giant got up to yell out, amen, they would even crouch down that much harder. Hallelujah. But the, the, uh, David's father sent him out there to take some cheese and crackers to his brothers and they took on the war. And all of a sudden, now Goliath come out there hollering. Oh. David said, who is this uncircumcised for this throne? Now, they said, he's a child. He, he's, he's, he's a gap. And, and, and the kings made a decree that whoever kills him, he'll give him his daughter, give him the kingdom. Yeah. David said, I'll go out and fight him. His brother said, you're foolish. Hallelujah. You're an idiot. Oh. You're just a child. Yeah. Jesus. Power. Oh, yeah. Whoa. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Demons tremble at the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. It's a dream. Amen. Come on, somebody. Come Amen. Somebody. Amen. Devil may brag and blow. Oh, come, come on. on. Come on. But every time the name of Jesus is mentioned, come on. Uh, right. He starts shaking. That's right. She does. Hallelujah. I remember one time. About 11 year old, about before I turned 12, may have been 12, and I was right in there from that age. And every day I'd go to the woods and pray three, four hours, sometimes seven, eight hours a day, every day. And I was down there on a Saturday, on a Friday, it was on a Friday. So then I prayed, I prayed all day. Got lost in the spirit of prayer. And when I woke up, I went down early that morning about 6.30. When I woke up, it's come out of the spirit of prayers about dusk dark. And I got my Bible. I always took me a little pint of water to drink during the day while I was praying. But that day I didn't even drink any. I just got lost in the spirit of prayer all day long, just praying and crying. While I was praying, my neighbor come down in the woods hated God. I thought I was far enough, about a mile or two miles back down in the woods behind their house. And I thought I was far enough away nobody could hear me praying. And my neighbor come down in the woods that day, loaded his gun, come down there, and just as I was getting ready to leave, I looked and I saw a spirit, a form of a man, it was a spirit. And that spirit walked up to me that evening and said, I come to take your life. You'll never pray again. Said, so today you're going to die. And I started to run. I mean, I was a kid. But when I started to run, something stood up in me like a child. I felt like I was about 12 foot tall. Come on. Come on. I looked down on that spirit. I said, I'll rebuke you in the name of Jesus. All right. Amen. And I'll send you back to hell where come you come on. from. Hallelujah. Lord, by the blood. Come on. You can't touch me. Right. You can't take my life come if on. you wanted to. Because I'm called to preach. Right. And what the policy that was given to me ain't been fulfilled yet. And you can't touch me. Hallelujah. Glory. Hallelujah. And that spirit turned and left. And I got home and my neighbors who lived on the other side of the man that come that day to kill me. Told me, he said, Brother Salisbury, he said, keep up the good work. I said, what do you mean? He said, man, you got the devil stirred. I said, boy, I hope so. And she said, the neighbor that lives right there by you across the branch, come down to the woods today, was going to kill you. Said he pointed his gun at you and pulled the trigger, and it just clicked. Uh -huh. And he pulled it again, it just clicked. Uh -huh. And he pulled it again, it just clicked. Said he got mad, went home. Jesse got around the uh, corner of his house. He threw his gun up there and pulled the trigger and it fired. Hallelujah. Praise God. <laughs> Told his wife, said, them bullets are defective. I said, I want some more. 
said, I'm going to kill that little red-headed preacher because he ain't going to never pray again like he's been praying around here. Rode in the gun and come back to the woods, tried to kill me, and the gun wouldn't do nothing but click. Come on, somebody. Oh, help me tonight. I went to church on Saturday morning. I was having a Saturday morning service up there. And I went to church that next morning. And I looked, and I looked, and there he was, sitting on one of the chairs. And I walked back to where he was, and I shook his hand, told him I was glad to see him in church, and I loved him. He said, I don't know what you got. I don't know who you are. He said, but I'm Hallelujah. You, I come to kill you, and my gun wouldn't do nothing but click. I'd get home, and it would fire. Right. He said, when I was down there with you, praying, I'd point that gun, and it would click. That's the power of God. Going off to prisons. Oh, yeah. oh God, help me today. Holy Jesus. We need something to change our world. Holy God. Yeah, we need the Spirit of God Holy to Jesus. change our world. Come on. Holy, our sons holy, and holy. daughters has got to be saved. Lord, I love you, Jesus. Come on, somebody. Lord, I love you, Father. Yes. Holy. Yes. Men used to preach. And the word they preach pricked people's hearts. Yes. yes. Come on, somebody. I want a message that will prick people's hearts. Yes, amen. I want something that will get a hold of people. Say, this is what you need. Yes. This is what you got to have. Somebody say amen. amen. Yes, hallelujah. I was blessed so much this year. Holy Jesus. Since Holy January. Jesus. I've not had but one weekend on. We have preached and gone and traveled and preached. The altars are beginning to fill up again. All right. Praise God. Somebody say amen. Amen. Yes. I want them 50 soul revivals. Yes, amen. I want them 100 soul revivals. Yes. yes. I want them 1,000 soul revivals. Yes, amen. Come on, somebody. Yes. We either preach a little we ain't. Right. Come on. We either believe a little we ain't. But Brother Salisbury, you don't understand the times has changed. Yeah, Got times it. has changed. The people's changed too. But he said, believe and it shall be. It shall be. He Amen. said, ask and it shall be given. Amen. It's the truth. Seek and you shall find. Yes. Knock and it will be opened unto you. Amen. He said, whatever you ask the Father in my name, I'll give it unto you. Amen. Come on, somebody. Yeah. Praise yes. God. Yes. Hallelujah. 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 People have to go to the hospitals. Holy Jesus. Come on, somebody. Holy Tired. God. Of us having to send our families and friends to the morgue. Hallelujah, God, hallelujah, hallelujah. Come on, somebody. Oh, ring, glory, 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 glory. Oh, God, help me today. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Went to the doctor the other day just to get a little checkup. And I'll go about once or twice a year, and sometimes three times a year, get checkups. And I ain't got to because I know that I'm healed. So I went the other day and they were going to tell me they was going to do some blood work on me and she said, I want to listen to your heart. She listened to my heart. She said, you hurt me in your chest? And I said, no ma'am, I ain't. She said, you sure you ain't hurt me in your chest? I said, no ma'am, I ain't hurt me in my chest. Come on, bro. So she listened to my back back here and told me to take a deep breath, took a deep breath. And she said, you sure you ain't hurt me? Come on. And I said, ma'am, I know if I was hurting, I ain't stupid. <laughs> I was born at night, but not last night. Because oh, no, no. I'm from Mississippi, don't mean I fell off the back of no turnip truck and hit my head either. Come on, brother. Yeah. She said, I'm going to do an EKG on you. I said, go ahead, but you ain't going to find nothing. She done an EKG on me. Oh, God, I found an abnormality in your heart. She told her nurse, said, go call the ambulance. I said, don't you go call no ambulance on me. I'm all right. Ain't nothing wrong with me. She said, oh, you need to be at the hospital right now. I said, well, I need to go to the hospital. I, I, let me go up here and pick my wife up. We're down to one vehicle right now. And 
and I, I need to go pick her up and I'm in the vehicle up here and she's at home and if I'm going to the hospital I want my wife with me because there ain't nothing wrong with me man it wasn't but a second here come the men and that ambulance service and throwed me over on that gurney and took me up in that ambulance and popped an IV in this arm and took me up to their EKG machine and they said have you ever had a heart attack before I said no I ain't never had no heart attack before they said, yeah, you had a heart attack before. I said, well, I ain't. So a lot of machines are showing us that you either have a heart attack or you have a one right now. I said, I ain't having no heart attack. Thank I you. said, my heart's all right. Thank I said, this you, is Jesus. the stupidest thing I ever seen. I said, God's going to show you a bunch of crazy folks up. And I get to the hospital, and you going to keep me there. I'm going to be all right. Got me to the hospital, man. They wheeled me in there and throw me over on one of their journeys. And here comes the doctor's flying in there and the nurse's flying in there and they was drawing blood and hooking me up to their heart machines and doing all kinds of stuff. Hallelujah. About 30 minutes later that doctor come in there. He said, well, my EKG says ain't nothing wrong with you and the uh, enzymes uh, ain't showing nothing wrong with you. I said, I told him ain't hey, nothing wrong with me. Praise God. Somebody say amen. I was at home in about an hour after I left the doctor's office. What do you mean? Did you get up and walk out of there? I said, I sure did. But I walked out there with a good report. Thank you, Lord. I'm healed. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. I'm healed. Yes. I'm healed. Yes. You know, Hallelujah. So believe what we believe. Preach what we believe. Believe what we preach. Yes. Pray what we believe. Amen. Believe what we pray. Yes. Amen. You know, she's able to do it. Yes. And abundantly yes. even of the all that we can even ask our things. Yes. God did it yesterday. God can do it today. Amen. Somebody say yes. Yes. Hallelujah. The yesterday, today, and for yes. Yes. Don't you appreciate Jesus? Amen. Yes. Give the Lord a hand. Come on. Thank you, Lord. Give the Lord a hand. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. You know the devil wants to put doubt in my He didn't say doubt. He said believe. Uh huh. He said if you believe, all things will be possible. All yeah. things. And we all know we're serving God. Mm -hmm. God that created the world. Thank you, Jesus. You Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. God. Thank you, Lord. Lord, I love so you, Jesus. Well under this tent, Bethel Springs, Thank yeah. you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. He said, Thank you, Jesus. Holy Jesus. He said, As your faith, so be it unto you. Yeah. I need a five gallon bucket full of God. No, you don't. Blessed Jesus. He said, Faith is a grain of a mustard seed. That's right. Yeah. That seed's so tiny. Yeah. Yes, it is. They talk about the mustard greens we eat. Now, nah, come on. Talking about the kind that grows up into a long orange tree. Mm -hmm. The birds of the fowl come. Birds the of the air come and nest in it. That seed's so tiny, just about have to have a magnifying glass yeah, to see it. I used to have a bunch of them, not gave them all away, brought to me from over to it. They're so tiny, just about have to have a magnifying glass to see right. that seed. He said, that much. You'll be able to say with this mountain now be down the moon. That's right. Yes. Cast in the sea of the yes. 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 Somebody say amen. Yes. yes. Hallelujah. As a missionary. Holy Jesus. Over in the foreign countries. Was preaching them. One day he said, God, I want you to moon this mountain. He looked up at it as a huge, huge mountain. 
And he said, God, remove this mountain. He didn't say how far to move. He said, God, remove this mountain. And there had been a bunch of geologists and seismologists and all those big time scientist folks over there have been studying that mountain for years and they measured it. And the next day they was out there and they told this missionary, he said, you ain't gonna believe this, that that mountain moved two inches. Praise God. And all these years we've been measuring it, we just finally got it. Measured again and said, it moved two inches from where it was at before. You uh-huh. might say, well, that's stupid. He didn't ask God how far to move that That's mountain. it. But that was enough to prove to him yes. that there's power in prayer. Yes. Lord, I'm not tired. Yes. Hallelujah. Bless you. That was enough to him to prove to him. Jesus. What faith can do. Holy Father. Holy Jesus. Yes. Lord, I'm not Yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise God. Don't glory, you glory, God. glory, yes. glory, 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 Jesus. Yes. Oh, Lord, I love you, Jesus. God's going to give you a total miracle in your body. Thank you, Jesus. Your ministry ain't going to your Jesus. Lord. You're going to be preaching to the Lord comes Jesus. back. Thank you, Jesus. Death ain't knocking at your door. Devil's a liar. But there is a complete healing going down through your body. Hallelujah. Down to every artery. Every capillary, everything, all down through every blood cell, everything in your body is being rejuvenated and remade. Jesus is healing you right now, sir. Yes, From the top of your head, even to the sole of your feet, you're being made whole. You're going to preach a long time. Yes, hallelujah. Long. The greatest revivals are yet to be had. For the Lord God of the heavens shall open many, many doors. And there shall be some hundred soul revivals, some two hundred soul revivals, said the Lord. Even some thousand soul revivals. For the Lord God of the heaven has spoken it. For I'll anoint you fresh this night. And I'll send you to places that you never dreamed of going, said the Lord. And I'll use you mightily to lay hands on the sick and they'll recover completely. Yea, the Lord God of the heaven shall fill your altars. For the Lord has spoken it. Doing missionary work and I squall like a baby. And I said, God, I don't want to go to Kenya, Africa. So send me to Africa. Let me go to Africa and preach. And a few days after I prayed that, I, that night I had a dream. And I was preaching in Kenya, Africa. And I'll tell you, thousands received the Holy Ghost. Notable miracles just took place and I speaking the word. And several years later, I was preaching revival down on the coast. The pastor who in Mississippi, we were, the pastor took me out to eat that afternoon, Sunday afternoon. And there was a black girl come up. She said, you, you Brother Salisbury. You Brother Salisbury. And I said, yes, ma'am, I'm Brother Salisbury. She said, you came to my country, Kenya, Africa, and you preached a crusade with he said, my mama got healed when you laid hands on her. And I said, ma'am, I ain't never been to Kenya, Africa. She said, yes, your brother Salisbury. She said, you came to my country and you preached a crusade. And said, thousands received the Holy Ghost. And she said, I was one of them that received the Holy Ghost. And I spake in tongues. He said, you even baptized me. And I said, no ma'am, I've never been to Africa. She said, yes you have. Hallelujah. 
I believe God's fixing to take us through. Even if he has to do it in the Holy yeah. Ghost. Yeah. I with all of my heart and I remember yeah. that dream. Hallelujah. That took me in a dream to Africa yeah. in the spirit and I preached to those people wow. in Kenya. Hallelujah. I'm telling you, folks, revival yeah. is in hand. Yeah. Holy Jesus, oh, holy Jesus. Stupid enough to believe. Yes. Yes. Oh. Hallelujah. That's all he asked us to do. Hallelujah. That's it. That's it. Yes. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Oh. Thousands, thousands, and thousands of miles over the years. We've flown all over the United States. And I tell you, I ain't ready to quit now. Uh uh. Ain't no heart attack gonna get me. Praise God. My heart's healed. All right. Yeah, yes, same man. Look. My arteries is clean. They tried to tell me one time I had a heart attack. If I did, God must have healed me. Yes, yeah, same man. <laughs> told me I had blocked arteries. When I went in and had a heart cap done, I was all right. Couldn't find nothing. And whatever he knows, he's still God. Yes, right. he is. How many of y'all wants to go in? Yes, amen. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Glory, 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 glory. Don't you love him? Yes. Oh, Jesus, we love you, Father. Jesus. Holy Lamb, holy Lamb, holy Lamb. Thank you, Jesus. The enemy hates your guts. Blessed Jesus. He's tried to destroy you. Blessed Jesus. You've gone through a lot. You've faced a lot. You've gotten weak. But there's always been a spirit of God crying out in your heart. Yes. Oh, God Jesus. told me to tell you to get ready, Jesus. my daughter. Bless it, Lord. For it's time to rise and shine. For the light has come. And the glory of the Lord has risen upon you. Bless it, Jesus. I've chosen it. And I called you. Yes. The Lord's mission to change your whole ministry. Thank you, Jesus. Your whole outlook. God's mission to change you. There's a fire of God. Holy Father. Mission to come into your spirit and yes. into your heart. Like you ain't experienced in a long hallelujah, time. Jesus. He loves hallelujah, hallelujah, God hallelujah. loves you, daughter of the Lord. Jesus. And I was saying that he be strengthened this night. Know that I, the Lord, has heard your cries. And I, the Lord, shall surely move. And I'll show you my glory. I'll show you my yes. power. Yea, you shall be one of those that will be standing in this in town hour. Said the Lord. Man, I feel the Holy Ghost tonight. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, Father. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. Jesus. Give God some praise. Thank you, sir. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Give God some praise. Love you, Father. We love you, Jesus. Holy, 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 holy. End of the year. This area is fixing to have one of the greatest revivals that's ever known. Hallelujah, Jesus. Lord, we love you. Start right here. Hallelujah, hallelujah. To that next town. Yes. That is going on beyond that. Yes. Going up yonder in Jackson. Then I'm seeing it going yonder way. Bless and I'm seeing it going back that way. Selmer. Thank you, Jesus. And yes. Oh, God, I see revival. Call yes. in Mississippi. 
Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Going on down in Alabama. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. I see revival breaking out. Hallelujah. Oh, God, I see sons and daughters coming to get the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. So we all see sons and daughters that you can get filled with the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. Jesus started preaching that we're running from the call and fighting their call. Hallelujah. Oh, God, I feel the Holy Ghost tonight. Yes, they are. Brush Harbor days are coming back. Yes, yeah. they are. Please, I've been thinking about setting up the Brush Harbor there while they are. Praise God. Not next door to my yard after I talked to the man the other day. He said, well, we'll celebrate. We'll just set one up then. Praise God. All the people there begging for a move of God. They ain't getting it where they're going, so they're going to go. Amen. Amen. You know, people are supposed to get hungry. Yes, yes they are. They're going to go somewhere. Yes. And we ain't got it. They can leave us and go with the king. Yes, they will. I don't want to go nowhere. I want to get it. No, right. amen. Yeah. That's a oh, right. Yeah. Amen. I'm going to give you a chance to help us out tonight. I'll tell you there's a person here that could give a hundred dollars if you would. Bless it, Jesus. There's four that's got a twenty in your pocket. Bless it, Jesus. If you don't pay the Lord, God will bless you. Bless it, Jesus. Give to this ministry. Bless it, Father. Give Put it in good ground. God bless you. Bless it, yes, Jesus. We need your help. We don't have just gas to make it up here on. We got a ball in Georgia and So I need your help. Listen to the Lord. Bless it, Don't Jesus. fail God. I know yes. he knows God knows yes. what you got. Yes, he does. God knows where you got it at. God yes. knows where you got it here. There's Amen. a person here tonight. You got it stuck back. In fact, there's two here. Bless it, Jesus. Got it hid, old, kind of square and small. Bless it, Jesus. Hid down here, built old. You need to thank you, Lord. Jesus. Yes, I may. Praise God. Mm -hmm. It's a person that's got it hid in your car. If you'll obey bless the Lord. Bless it, Jesus. God will bless you, Father. Yes, I may. God, I need your help, Jesus. Yes, Jesus. God will live by faith. Bless it, Lord. God, I trust you and I believe in you to make the way you always have. Yes, amen. God, I need your help tonight, God. And I ask you to speak to every heart to not fail you in this offering. Lord Jesus, speak to every soul what to give. Lord, I need the people's help. God, I know we got some here that ain't got it. Bless it, Jesus. God, if they would give what they got, for the weekends out, Lord. Blessed Jesus. You'll give it back to them. Lord, I feel it in the Holy Ghost. Blessed Jesus. God, there's three, Lord. God, if they'll give what they got, their middle barrel will never run dry in the cruise. Blessed Jesus. God will never run out. Amen. He will never yes. run out. The cruise will never run dry. Lord, Thank speak to Jesus. every heart in Jesus', Jesus. name. Give it back to them, Lord, and bless them. Bless them coming and going bless you, Jesus. in Jesus' name. Amen. Yes, amen. amen. God bless you. Come bring your offerings unto the Lord. You, God bless you. Bless you, my sister. Praise God. Bless, you, bless you, sister Brenda. Bless you, Jesus. Amen. Bless you, Lord. Bless, bless you, Lord. 
Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Don't fail, God. Thank you, Jesus. Bless you, brother. Appreciate you so much and your family. Bless you, Thank you, Lord. Appreciate all those who work harders that are here tonight. Bless you, my brother. Appreciate you so much. Bless you, Jesus. And everybody obeyed the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. God, there's two more of God that need to be obedient. I ain't going to waste no time. Please give it back to Sister Brenda. And God, there's two more people that need to listen to you, Lord, in this offering tonight. Don't let them fail you. God, I know what you spoke to my heart. Don't let them fail you, Jesus. In Jesus' name, amen. amen. God bless you tonight. And we going to... Brother Carter, Jesus. later on, I was supposed to come preach for him here a while back. Bless you, Jesus. Didn't get to, but I sure do want to come back and preach for him sometime Bless in the Jesus. future. And I'll um, tell you, I like Tennessee. I like the Bible. Bless I Jesus. like coming to Tennessee and preaching. Praise and, God. Uh, we've been up around McKenzie, Tennessee, preaching Chattanooga and all of that part of Tennessee, all up across the Tennessee. And, Different places been here, preach for Sister Randy here while back at the church. So did like it. Amen. And we want to get back some more. Praise Thank God. You, appreciate Jesus. you, Sister Randy, come and take the Thank you, service. Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank Give you, the Lord a hand if you need. Thank you, Lord. I tell you what, God is good to us. Yes, He is. Hallelujah. I, I appreciate every night that God has moved like He has. Isn't it wonderful, Sister Dolores? I think God is so good. He sees every need we have, don't He? Amen. And He meets that need. Like, I, I won't let you go real soon. Because I know it's raining and I know you get home, get your rest, and be out here at the bar. <laughs> <laughs> Hallelujah. Brother Ray will be preaching tomorrow night. And I tell you what, I, yeah, I know the Holy Ghost is going to come down just like it did tonight. Hallelujah. I tell you, I appreciate each and every one. I tell you, I appreciate what God has done for Brother Danny and his whole family. And that's something. My goodness. And that's uh, Brother coming with us tonight. What a blessing. I tell you, God has just been good to all of us, hasn't he? He's just wonderful. Hallelujah. I tell you what, I, I see Brother Danny and his and, his, and Sister Wanda getting stirred up. Hallelujah. Brother Danny's going to be preaching for long. <laughs> I tell you what, God has got to work for him to do. Amen. And I tell you what, God is just putting him right where he wants him to be. Hallelujah. Lord, we appreciate you. Lord, we thank you for this night. Lord, we thank you for this word and this great stirring, God, that we feel among us. And Lord, I know each and every night that you're having your way, God. And God, you have done many great things, Lord, and you'll continue to do so. Lord, we love you, we praise you, we magnify you, oh Lord. Oh, yes, hallelujah, hallelujah. Thank you. I really appreciate Brother Randy being here tonight. Yes. Yes. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Lord, oh, Lord, hallelujah, hallelujah, oh, yes. hallelujah. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Woo, hallelujah. Oh, I feel the Holy Ghost. Yeah, amen. Oh, yes. My goodness, hallelujah. Yes. Y'all just wait. Well, these, uh, you know, I was standing over there the other night. My back was just about to break in two. <laughs> I said, Lord, I don't know how much longer I can stand here if you don't do something with this back. Hallelujah. And a sister was standing right over there. It come with Brother Haney. She walked over to me and she placed her hand on my back back there. And she started praying for my back. Hallelujah. All up and down my spine. She said, Lord, move for her. This pain has got to go right down the name of Jesus. And it left. All right. Hallelujah. God is good. Amen. <laughs> He's good. I tell you what. He's wonderful. Just wait till I get my complete healing from head to toe. I'm going to run around the tent. <laughs> I'm going to run and leap the wall like David did. Hallelujah. I tell you what. Some of you that's young around here ain't got nothing wrong with your bodies. Hallelujah. When you feel the Holy Ghost, you ought to take off. <laughs> you ought to run and rejoice. You know, David, when the ark come back into the city, David got out there and threw his outer clothing off. The Bible says naked, but you know they wore several layers back then. So he threw out his outer layer. <laughs> and he just danced. Woo! Boy, he just cut a rug around that ark. <laughs> Myron and his wife didn't like it too much. Look at that king out there. 
messing around like that, acting like a fool. And I tell you what God saw in her heart, and He caused her to be barren from that moment right. forth. I never did, did it, Brother Cook. And that's because she despised David. That's right. For dancing to the Lord. Amen. I tell you what, they can call me crazy, holy roller if they want to. Hallelujah. I'm going to praise my God because I love him. He is wonderful. And I tell you, I appreciate Brother Randy and Sister Yvonne for driving up here and being with us tonight. My, my, my. Appreciate each and every one of you weathering this weather and coming on out. That shows that a hunger is getting a hold of us. All right. Oh, this is the It just shows wow. us that God is doing something in us. Good. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Let's say, Lord, thank you, Father. Lord, that this ground is still dry. All right. Yes, praise God. I know right over there a little bit it's wet, but <laughs> the majority of this has stayed dry. And I yes. thank the Lord. Sister Pam, come on. Appreciate Sister Pam. Yes. She's been helping me in the church ever since I've been here. I tell you what, she has stuck through thick and thin. <laughs> and I tell you, I appreciate it. And she has really battled. But God has brought her all the way through. Hey, yes. Sister Payne. Tell you what, I appreciate her. She's been a strength to the ministry. And I tell you what, and she honors the ministry. Yes, she does. And that's where it counts. You honor the leader that God sends to you. Hallelujah. I tell you what, God will bless you. And He'll always move for you. See, you see, He would send His people pastors and shepherds. Hallelujah, that would lead and guide them and show them the way to go. I tell you what, Brother Carter's church is blessed. Y'all are blessed to have the bishop like y'all do. Yes, you are. Hallelujah. And I tell you what, and all these other churches that God's got around here, they're blessed too. Brother Randall's church is blessed. Hallelujah, because they got that man of God there. Okay, what, when we was in Jamaica and we was... I know I told y'all about the Bushman. Some of you hadn't heard it. But Sister Kathy, she's a black sister that went with me. And we went over there. <laughs> Hallelujah. Precious sister. I tell you, she wanted to be here so bad, but her um, pastors put up a tent, so she's trying to be there. But Sister Phyllis said, we usually don't go to church at night because the Bushman come out, and we never know when they're going to walk out. <laughs> I said, Sister Phyllis, the Lord's protection is among us. I said, we'll be fine. And so we all walked up them steps. And Brother Randall walked out there. And Sister Kathy walked. And here I come. And here come this bush man out of the bush. <laughs> he had a machete about that long. And he had sugar cane on his shoulder. I said, we all abruptly went. <laughs> Brother Randall said, how are you doing? How are you doing? We're going to go to church. <laughs> and that just broke the ice. And before we got on the church, he was cutting off Sister Anita pieces of sugar cane and, and giving it to us and telling us to taste it. You know, God always keep you on him. He has angels about you. Hallelujah. You just always obey the Lord and the Lord will always see you through. Yes, right. Sister Pam, she's going to pray over the offering and dismiss us. Tell everybody you can about tomorrow night. Will the Randall be finished too? And I tell you what, he'll bless your soul. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Father.